Hey guys, welcome to Lama Tales. My name is Mama Lama and we are excited to have you here with us today. The, our channel is inspired by our love for llamas and Minecraft. So my son and myself decided to create our very own channel to share the awesome things that we do in Minecraft. We like to do funny things, we like to do awesome things, we like to do scary things, and we just wanna share it with you guys on the channel. We are super excited to have you guys with us here today, and let's jump into episode number one. All right, guys, it is day one. We just spawned into a brand new world. This will be the world I will be using for 2023. What is that? Does that look like ice? Let's go and have a look there. Now, guys, for you guys that don't know me yet, I suck at ice biomes, really. Snowy biomes really suck for me. I always die in them. I always forget to put the boots on, and then I fall in a hole, and I can never recover my stuff. So this is really, really bad for me. But it only looks like a little bit of ice, not too much, which means I don't, I have a good opportunity not to die. What is that? Oh, that looks like, is that a village or is that something like another structure? You never know in Minecraft, guys. Treasure is all over the place. You have to go and inspect things. You have to go and look at things. Oh, look at the pony. It's so beautiful. That is such a beautiful pony. I need to come back for it. All right, guys. As you guys always know, food is essential in Minecraft. So let me grab some seeds here. I know it's important to get some seeds in the beginning. I like to stock up on them on day one so that it's easier for me to concentrate on some of the other builds later on. But let's go and have a look at that structure. I'm really, really intrigued with that structure. I've never ever spawned close to a structure like that. So this will be really, really interesting for me. What does this look like? Oh, this is... Oh, there's some coal. There's some coal. Uh, whoa, guys. Is this one of those cities where those guys under the water? Oh, yes, it is. Oh, no. I don't like these guys. I die to them a lot in the water. These are drowns. Zombies that have drowned. Oh, no. Oh, no, 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 no. This is not good. This is not good, guys. I don't want to be hanging around here at night. Oh, there's one. Uh, no, this is not good. This is not good. This is not good. Although there's a lot of coal here. I think step number one is to get one of those trees down. So I can get some tools going here, guys. This is not good. go down there because I did see some coal down there and coal is very important especially on the early game because you don't know if you're really gonna find so let's get our crafty table going here uh, oh. am I hearing a skeleton <sighs> why must the first game be so Okay, so for you guys that don't know, I die a lot. Like, a lot in this game. Okay, I've got a crafty table. I've got some seeds going here. Um, and now, I need to just get myself a stone pickaxe. And once I have... Alright, let's get some... All right, so we've got the basics going here. Let's just get some. Um, I don't know. I don't know. Okay. All right, let's get some coal going here. Let's not disturb these guys too much. They come chasing after me. Because I literally have just like a wooden... Mama. Oh, it's going down. Okay. So that means we need shelter. Alright, the best way to do this is... Let's just have a look before we actually close ourselves in. I think the best thing to do is to just go straight forward and just dig a hole right into some blocks on the outside. 
outside, you know, just to just to close me up there. I think I should be okay like this. Hey guys, come here. I need some. <coughs> hey, dongers. I'm building my own XP form. <laughs> Where are the rest of you? <coughs> So it was night and now it's time to find our perfect place for our perfect house because that is the most important part of minecraft but i think we're gonna have to set sail guys let's set sail let's go let's go let's set our sail let's see where we need to go right oh there's sugarcane guys quick detour quick detour we need some sugarcane we always need sugarcane guys you will notice on this channel i do make a lot of detours when i see things Let's grab it, grab it, grab it, grab it. Let's go, 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 go. Oh, there's some more sugar cane. Another detour, guys. Sorry, sorry. We need to make another detour. I know that we are cruising here, but we need another detour because there's sugar cane. We have to have to get the sugar cane, guys. We need books. We need pie. Oh, there's a village. A village, guys. How awesome is that? We've got a village so close. We didn't even have to travel that far. Oh, I love being close to villages. Villages means villages, and villages means trade. So I don't want to go too far from this village because I think we might be setting up shop close to it because I suck at getting the villages into things. So I like to be close to them whenever I can, guys. So this is the easiest way. Let's see what the heck is going on. Oh wow, they got like a little docking station here, man. They are sophisticated. Right, so let's dock the boat there. <laughs> Slowly. Right, guys, so this is now my second day in Minecraft. Let's have a look here. There's not much going on in the village. Oh, my bed. There's not much going on in the village, but I'm sure we can get a couple of things here. Let's see what we can actually utilize in here. Now, I'm a bit different. I don't take things in villages. Too. I don't take, I like to take a lot of things out of villages. You know, I like to take the basics out of there. Or like things that are really difficult to make or takes up a lot of, of iron to make. But it's a nice little village. There's some piggies. There's some food. There's farmers. Really looks really awesome here. There's some wheat bales, which are very, very important. Let's see what's going on in the house. Oh! You naughty child. Why do you close the door in someone's face? Oh, yeah. Oh, hello, villagers. How are you? I am new here. Please be kind to me. Oh. Oh, hey, bales, guys. You cannot leave here without wheat bales. You cannot. You need bread. And it is essential to you succeeding in Minecraft. Thank you, villagers, for giving me this beautiful wheat bales i need them i need them i'm um, oh no the farmer saw me oh no run run bye farmer please make me some more <gasps> oh cat a black cat fishing 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 i need a cat please kitty please accept me please yes i got the cat i got my first animal in my <laughs>
eight without cheese yep. or a bucket. Yeah. Let's get a bucket going. Get some of these beautiful pink flowers. No lady can be without some pink flowers. Oh, they're so beautiful. I love dying with them. I love putting them all over the place around my house. some iron guys mission accomplished oh please let there be enough iron here guys i already almost died like 70 times this is like serious please 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 i need some good iron here that's not two that's number three. Oh, there's two more at the back it would give me about five stacks that's not bad mission accomplished oh there's another one so that's six stacks awesome guys so i got myself a horse and i need a saddle now there's no saddles in the village i checked everywhere that means i'm gonna have to get it fishing but i've also got a couple of cats that i want to go and catch in the village as well so uh, the fish is essential let us now get to fishing where's the music <laughs> the loot guys we got some really cool stuff awesome awesome we got a saddle and some other cool things as well okay guys so this is the layout yeah. of the house i'm just going to quickly take you through everything i want to build so this is going to be the main building here right here yeah. i want to put that in then i've got the entrance to the building this one i had a creeper explode here so i'm going to get this fixed up but here is going to be an extra maybe like for my horse so so for you guys that don't know yet, I actually got myself a horse and I found myself some awesome gold armor down in a dungeon. I also found a skeleton. Oh no, no, it's a zombie dungeon, which I'm going to turn into an XP farm because I did die again and lose all my 20 levels for enchantment. But let's not worry about that, guys. So and then right at the back here, I have my mine entrance. So I like to build a nice big tower on top. And then I've got my mine entrance down here. And the mine entrance is looking absolutely fabulous. I did like a whole gold kind, uh, a glass kind of wall here. So it's nice. You can stand here and have a look out and everything. I got myself a whole lot more cats. And these are all my mine shafts that I'm going to be doing. So I've only started digging in this one here down here. I got some of my armor here. My cat is there. I think you need to sit down right there and help look after. I've got my furnaces in. I got some boxes. I just want to bring some green stuff in here. And I want to hang a very nice lantern down here. So that it really, really lights up the room and makes it look really nice. So this is my underground mining area. But the important part right now, guys, is I need to get the starter house done. Because as you guys can see, I had a creeper explosion already. So I've got to get this done. My iron is oxidizing. And yeah, that's my awesome horse. So guys, I'm going to take you back to the point. And I'm not really good at the time lapse thing, but I am practicing at that. So for this video, I'm simply going to stand back at my main spot. And I'm just going to look out and say before and ta-da guys here is my starter house as you guys can see i have this 
beautiful little fountain in the bottom here. I absolutely love it. I want to get some fish in there. I got the tower going up. I just got to do some final decor work on it. I got the chimney, the roof, everything in it. I decided to go with a plain, simple build. I didn't want to use too many different woods, but let's quickly do our house tour. All right, guys, so as you guys can see, we've got the beautiful pond here. It's absolutely beautiful. I love it. I'm going to get some fish in here. we got our beautiful chimney here. It's absolutely stunning, the smoke coming out the top. The only thing i got to work on is i got to get working on this front porch yet. I haven't done that yet. i got to get some more resources. Here is my beautiful, beautiful horse. Guys, I need you guys to give me, in the comment section, give me a name for this guy. But I'm also going to need three more names. Because for some odd reason, all the wandering traders that come here decide to leave their llamas here. <coughs> I will lost one of them, but the other three are still here. So we need names for them as well. We got the beautiful stable here. Hey llamas. Hey llamas. And I've also got another stable here that I put the one in. I'm at some point gonna try and get them in, but they're very stubborn. You guys know how llamas are. Alright, and here's my copper still oxidizing, but there's the upstairs here. I absolutely love the red windows. I always make them carry your red windows. I can hear the wandering trader. He's not really wandering around or maybe living in my house rent free. And then on the inside, guys, the inside tour is absolutely beautiful. As you come in here, you've got the beautiful little area where you can sit and chill with your friends, have something to eat. I've got the beautiful kitchen going there in the back. This is the cooker. I've got, I just got to do some basic small stuff, some small decor stuff, guys. As you guys can see, we've got some cupboards up here. We're going to fill it up with some food and we've got some beautiful kitchen area i decided to keep it plain and simple here you can literally go inside to the llama but he's gonna poke his hole in again no you cannot stay inside go away you sleep outside then the upstairs area here i've got a beautiful upstairs area where my bed is i just gotta get another bed in here and finish up with the banners and stuff i gotta get some sheep okay and i got a beautiful little couch rocking here I left a hole there, I need to close that. But I, I do love the look and feel. I will be expanding on it as I go along. I think for up to now, just the way it looks, I absolutely love it. I want to do some finer detail work on it. And then obviously here is the mine that we go down to. And then uh, we've also got the upstairs area. I actually want to put some pillars in here, some wooden pillars to just make it look a little bit more realistic. So the house is going to come along. I'll give you guys a final tour once I've got everything done. This is the upstairs area. Obviously, in any castle, you've got to keep your treasures in the top. So here is beautiful treasures, guys, that I get to pack away all my beautiful things that I don't want everybody to steal. And then it, from the second area, I thought of creating like a little workshop here. And that's absolutely going to look beautiful. And then I also got to fix up the stairs a bit because I built it nicely, but I kind of like collided here. So I've got to do something here. I'm still going to think there. Downstairs is um, my cats and my mining area. And that's pretty much the house tour, guys. I've got the upstairs. I've got. Hey, guys, thank you so much for joining me in episode number one. It was awesome having you guys here with me and being able to share this awesome build with you guys. In the next episode, we need to get some food going. So in episode two, we are going to build ourselves a really, really nice greenhouse. I've got a really, really great inspiration for that. I was watching a video of a great YouTuber and I really, really want to copy their stunning greenhouse. So in episode two, guys, you guys are going to catch me doing some nice greenhouse stuff. I've got some cows. I've got to get some sheep and some chickens going as well. And I would love you guys to join me in the next episode. Thanks guys for joining me and have an awesome, awesome day. Thank you.